Hey there, it's Brooks here from DocumentSnap.com, and today we're going to be talking about how to install a Fujitsu ScanSnap without a DVD or other optical drive. So if you want to get the ScanSnap drivers onto your computer and you don't have an optical drive, you have a few options. The first is you can try and get the drivers as a download from Fujitsu. So you can either reach out to Fujitsu support, or you can come here and click on this link, which says Download Request Form for ScanSnap Setup Programs. And once you do that, you basically fill out this form. You'll need all these different part numbers. You'll need the, the part number, the serial number, your name and email address. And if everything works out okay, Fujitsu will send you a link to download the drivers. Now you can see here, if you have an earlier version, you don't even need to fill all of this out. You can just click that link here for any of these early versions like the S510M, 300M, etc. Now, you can definitely do that, but if you have another Mac in the house, there may be a better option. And that option is to use our other Mac and share its DVD drive. And then from there over the network, we can install the program by accessing that DVD drive using something called a remote disk functionality. So I'm going to show you how that works. Okay, so I'm here at my computer with the optical drive. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on DVD sharing. So I'm going to go up here to the Apple symbol go to System Preferences, and then you can see here there's an icon for sharing. So I'm going to click on that. And then right here, there's an option for DVD or CD sharing. So I'm going to check that. Now, by default, it might, it might have this checkbox saying, ask me before allowing others to use a DVD drive. Uh, that's up to you. I'm going to turn that off personally. But if you want to be notified, then go ahead and check that. So now that I have it on, I'm going to flip back to my computer and start using the remote disk functionality. OK, so I'm here at my computer now, my MacBook Air without an optical disk. And you can see here in the devices section, there's something called remote disk. So when I click that, you can see that my other computer, which is called Munich, shows up in the remote disk list because it has a shared DVD drive. So when I click it, you can see here's my uh, disk that I had, my ScanSnap driver disk, which I put into my Mac mini that I just set up to share. So when I click that, it'll mount the DVD and you can see here, here is the install package. So when I double click on that, it will start the installation program. And as far as your Mac's concerned, it'll be, It'll be exactly the same as if your DVD drive was plugged right into your computer. I'm not going to take you through the rest of the process because it's exactly the same as if you were had a local drive. Uh, you might find it a little bit slower than having a, a local drive, uh, but it still works perfectly fine. So those are two ways that you can install a Fujitsu ScanSnap on a computer that does not have an optical drive. For more tips, head on over to DocumentSnap.com. Thanks a lot.